Hello everyone, welcome back to Planet Base. We're still struggling with our oxygen after we nearly lost power for a good long time. We've got our plants are in a bad shape, so we are right now we're running in energy conservation mode. Which is all half essential things are turned off. So we've got a lot of people sitting doing nothing at the moment, but at least this should save some power so that we won't run out of oxygen again, which would be terrible for the plants. But we've managed to clean this area up a bit, so we are able to place down a goliath turbine here. Which is going to be nice, we are building another power collector in the background as well. We're running very low on food now, plants are still in a poor shape. We're gonna tack on a second oxygen generator here right now. That should hopefully get priority over anything else. And then we'll be able to save our plants and ourselves from starvation. We've got enough meals at the moment, but that's not gonna last too much longer unless we fix the plants up first. At least power's working, that's good. We're gonna turn our things back on, we're nearly at full power. There we go, oxygen generator has been built. So we're gonna have a lot more power to deal uh, a lot more oxygen to deal with soon. There we go, it initial drop of oxygen and now just watch as it increases back hopefully yep slowly but surely good we've overcome the oxygen crisis which means we'll have our food back up soon we've got nearly maxed power we've got another trader it's a medical trader 35 percent commission we sadly don't have enough food for once but we do have like 60 bioplastic. Actually, we're gonna wait. You're gonna stay there for a while, right? You Not if I press dismiss. God, I'm an idiot. Oh, uh, well. Things happen. That's my bad. I'm calling it. I'm accepting it. We're gonna add another power collector. We need power. More of it. We've got enough wind turbines up so that we can get some more power during the day uh, as long as there's wind but that might not always be enough oxygen here is doing fantastic again we're building driller robots that's good we've got visitors Yep, seems to check out. Nope! Intruders! Ah, damn it. Not again. At least an intruder. Nope, we have two. Yep, took long enough, guys. Sloppy work. Hey, guard, why aren't you helping your friend out? Come on! You're just sitting at the console like, I'm doing my work. We might lose Zikri. God. AI sometimes. Iris, please. Oh, no, we've got another medic inbound. Zikri is saved, thankfully. That is the downside of having an apparently good colony. Glowing Yelp reviews or something, I don't know. Got another power collector up, that's good. Lord knows we're gonna need it. I'm gonna start flattening this area up here. There we go, fit one in over there. Got a lot more wind production now, that's good. That's gonna help remedy the loss during the night. Are 
those truly visitors? Yep, they are. At least they seem to be. That's good. Got a small trader, electronics, by the look of things. We've got a patent for constructor robots. We don't really need constructor robots. Although I will take your carrier robots. I mean, it's a lot, but at the same time, I think we can do it. Yeah, it's gonna help out in the lo in the short run. We are up to six driller bots now. That's great. That means we have a lot less people getting injured in the mines. I can't applaud that enough. So, with the sword in medicinal plants, we're gonna replace this with wheat. There we go. We don't need the medical plants as much anymore. We're gonna get some money from the visitors in a second. Power storage is low, there we go. That's why I've increased the capacity yet again. Because no matter what, wind power remains unreliable. Having said that though, the wind is starting to pick up again. So we'll be fine soon. Just gonna hope that the wind keeps blowing. Or at the very least, that this solar panel gets built soon. That's gonna help build up some more power. We're probably gonna add another storage in here. And then maybe a dorm. I'm sure we can flatten this area out if we try hard enough. Got a trading ship landed. It's a small one. It's a general one. Eh, we could. I'm gonna give you a moment. Looks like visitors. Looks like proper visitors as well. Don't forget to connect you up. Building up microchips. We've got 50 coins for their services. Uh, for our services, I mean. Do we really want a massive storage? I think we're fine without a massive storage. We can however go for the robots. Yeah, we're just gonna buy robots I suppose. There we go. We offset the coin loss a bit. Gonna hit go in here, make sure food production is maximum. I'm gonna go back to flattening this air this hill out. Power storage is critical. Right. Disable structure, disable structure. Do a progress check on the amount of driller bots, that's nine. Eight, I mean. I can't math at the moment. We could shut this down, but to be fair, wind is starting to pick up. 
And take a look at resources. Don't need that. We're gonna scrap you later. We can probably fit another one in here. I mean, it's still wind power, but at least we're breaking even. We were breaking even for a second. Oh, there we go. It's picking back up. It's picking back up. We're building back up ever so slightly. There we go. More visitors. That's fine. 254 coins at the moment. Food's building up again. Power's doing fine now. That's good. I'm gonna build another very large solar panel. Hopefully it'll be finished during the day. That'll be more daytime power for us. There we go, General Trader. You sell a robot at commission. That's fair. I'm gonna give you a gun. Or not. But GM onions don't need them. There we go. And allow colonists again. Thirty six. The power's going down, but we've got the solar panel. I think we just built the other guy. Yep. There we go. Finish the connection, guys. Come on, this is basic engineering. Christ. That was a waste of power. Power monger reached. 500 megawatts, uh, kilowatts produced. I don't know why it says kilowatts, but... Oh well, who am I to argue? This isn't a city, this is a colony. This is a base. It's a planet base. Woohoo. It's not meant to be a huge power plant made for shipping power back to Earth or whatever. We're not playing Anno. There we go, more battery space there. We're actually doing quite well with the solar power during the day. Wind is picking up, that's good. Going back down. Visitors paid for services. Wrong button. Food's going meh. Might have just built another biodome over here, that's fine. More visitors, more colonists. Should be up to 91 people now, that's good. We should be able to place another one there, right? Guys, please, no. Freelance raw materials trader, 65% commission, just go. You're not worth selling food to. If someone wants to hold these materials for me, so I can place down more uh, more wind turbines, that would be great. We're gonna make them more efficient. I mean, sure, it costs more steel, but the power offset is worth it. Like, just the difference between these alone. It's nearly double, and it takes up way less spares. Which, in turn, takes up less bioplastic and steel. Now if some please can hold these bloody bits of metal. Come on. And I mean I know I'm asking you to buy to build things while we're over here, but come on. Oh, and we might have been building that one over here as well. Please, these few bits of metal, come on. It's not rocket science. Just 
Just make sure nobody gets trapped in here, that would be silly and stupid. And exactly what I expect to happen. There we go, we've got some mountain cleared. There we go, more mountains gone. Or hill, or whatever you want to call it. Terrain bump. Height map difference. More colonists. Someone please hold these bits of metal for God's sake. We're up to 10 driller bots. That should be enough for a while. But you're already building more. Haul these things. Come on. It's not... You're doing this on purpose, aren't you guys? God's sake. Oh no, wait. I just disabled these because I'm an idiot. Right, that's literally impossible. I am an idiot. At least they should be hauling things now. <sighs> but they're not. Enable everything, come on. Bring them to me. It's a Christmas miracle. There we go. And we up fit in another one over there. Great. Now we're cooking with gas. While we're at it. Now we're building plants. I didn't have a punchline for that one, I'm sorry. Maybe it's for the best. Come on, lemmings. Build it. Armed intruders detected. We lost a worker to combat wounds. Vivan, you're gonna live, probably. This is why we can't have nice things. We already there is up, we've got a colonist ship. We've got this one being built, that's good. Well, this one is built and connected for once. No, you're... If I could rupture your suit and have you choke to death. I swear to God, we're wasting power! Come on! It's just, you're breaking my heart! Great! Now we've got a robot over here and we finally have a connect up, but there's no more need. It's already too late, thanks! No, don't want anything to do with you. Jack the ripoff. <laughs> okay, that should help. Or not. Fine, we'll do it your way, game. At the very least, we are about to hit a hundred people, which is a third of the way there. We're gonna go into overdrive mode soon. There we go, more food and some medical plants so we can trade. Food's building back up, that's good. We're gonna need that. People are starting to become unhappy. That's a great moment to build another multi-dome century reached good it's 
temporarily connect that so we can flatten these some more. We've got the frozen base achievement for having 100 people in the frozen base. Which you could be forgiven for thinking is misleading advertisement. There we go, that's the hill gone. Just like that. Build a multi dome, and we're gonna build a bar to celebrate. Got enough tomatoes being made at the moment. There we go, how's power doing? We're gonna switch you off for a second. Since we have a ship landed there at the moment, we don't need it operational. How's the robot business doing? Good! We're up to 62% on that guy. We're gonna add in a second one. And that's just gonna be for carrier robots. And we'll switch this one over as well, seeing how we don't have a need for more than three driller robots at the same time. Although, I suppose it doesn't hurt to have a few spare lying around. Guys, really? You bloody idiots. Lock yourself up, why don't you? There we go. That's looking orderly. Not gonna have any connections up here, so we're gonna play some TV screens. Water fountains. Another TV screen. We're gonna wanna add a connection in there as well, just for the hell of it. Right, bar. You're gonna have all the drinks machines. People are going to have a lovely chat over there. And get some water over here as well. That's going to do it for now. Something broke down here. Or that's just them not having hauled the materials away just yet. There we go. Bar is being built. We've got... Vegetables being brought in. A lot of tomatoes, a bit of wheat. So they're gonna be happy to drink. Can't blame them. We've got more people coming in. We've got six guards at the moment. We're gonna have five people sitting guard in here now. We've got four consoles for four telescopes, so we're going to build another telescope over here. Security console built, good. We're not going to bother with radios this time around. I'm only going to bother with having a thousand prestige on the third and final planet, which will be the moon of a gas giant. It's going to be awesome, but we won't be able to use wind there, which I'm completely fine with, because screw wind. This planet is just reminding me why I hate wind power. In here, not in real life. I mean, in real life it's wonderful. I love green energy. Just the thought of being more efficient can be great at times. There we go, we've got 100 food back built up. This is actually starting to come pretty close. We might have a few more power outlets here. Depending on how we choose to go. Do we want to add... Uh, yeah, we're going to need... Sleeping quarters. We're going to remove this airlock and we're going to build a large dorm here. Or maybe a cabin. Yeah, we're going to build a cabin here for morale. Like, why not? That's going to be 
an interesting reason for them to come here. And if it's not being used, we can always just build a standard dorm. We're going to expand that canteen for the future. Food production is doing fine. Just haul that steel over there, please. Thank you. Connect you up as close as possible. It's going to be close for these people. That's good. We're up to 12 driller robots. So we could add a fourth mine. With little to no problem. We're going to decrease priority on you. It doesn't really matter anymore. Colonists coming in. We're up to 106 people now, out of 120 that we got oxygen for. So, I think it might be a good idea to build oxygen generator over here, connect that up, make sure we don't get any problems building up. General trader, I don't know, raw materials. I mean, we don't need any ore at the moment. We don't need any starch. We're just gonna sell food. The way it was meant to be in the initial planning phase. Give us all of your money. There we go. That's easy. We're gonna add another wor robot workshop. We're gonna add another repair hub. We've got a lot of spares, uh, uh, a lot of semiconductors going on right now. We've got some more colonists. Good. Welcome to the party. And we're going to start hightailing it towards the goal of 300 people. There's got to be a way we can fit something in here. Or is that the map order? Oh, God. Yes, we can't actually go further. That's annoying. It's perfect over here, but on the other hand... Power! Increase priority here. I want these working at all times. At all speeds. Preferably high speed. Hell, we might just add another processing plant. Why the hell not? There we go. We've got a cabin. Good. Bad, bad. Bad. No bed. And bed. 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 And bed. There we go. That's like seven beds for seven people. And they will be feeling good while they sleep there. Meanwhile, we've got more visitors coming in. Looks fine. Yep, they're all good. Can we add an airlock here? Maybe. No. We'll fit one over here. We have a trader landing. You're a food trader, so you naturally want to have some more food. At 60% commission. You know what? Fine. Don't say I never gave you anything. So it's out of oxygen. Just, just because they're being built. And we might have to connect them up over here. That's probably a good idea as well. I'm willing to go that far. What can we add? Uh, I don't know. We'll see in a second, I suppose. It's fine for now, anyway. There we go. Increase priority. We're going to want our workers... 
processing stuff instead of producing it in the mines. We've got 13 driller robots, so we're gonna build another mine. We can fit it. Come on, it was there a second ago. There we go. Connect you up to there. We're gonna lay out another um, anti-meteorite laser. Wouldn't be bad over here somewhere. There. That'll do it. But we're gonna call the episode here for now. So if you enjoyed the episode, please remember to leave a like below. It really does help out a lot. Leave a comment down below if you have anything to say. And I will see you all next time. Have a good one, folks.